she is wicked fast. He is too, for that matter. Not faster than my shotgun, though. Welcome back, everybody, to 70s, and I'm an old guy gaming, and we play this game on insane difficulty. The zombies are all set to nightmare speed, and we are on Alpha 19.1. All right, um... We, it uh, just turned morning not too long ago. I spent uh, the rest of the night looting the the rest of the grocery store. We got some food. We we didn't get a ton of food, but we got some. So you know we're not we're not doing bad on food at all. Uh, I bought these two sham chowders from Trader Joel right before he closed. Um, and let's see, a couple other things I made. Uh, I, I got another point overnight, and so I put, like I said I was going to do, I put that point in lock picking, and we now have um, 50 lock picks. Uh, I, I will use this jailbreaker the next time we have to break into something, but after that, it, you know, I mean, lock picks are so damn cheap, it doesn't matter. It takes, you know, 10, to, 10 lock picks to get into something, it takes 10, and sometimes it actually does, too. Um, so the plan for this episode is we're going to go back uh, to Trader Joel's town and speed run uh, the, the business strip again. Uh, but before we do that, and then, you know, depending upon how much time we have left over that, we might try and do one of those other quests. Um, there's one right next to Trader Joel. Uh, I mean, like right across the street. But the turn in, the next turn in, though, I think is going to be back to one of these other traders. So we'll see. <clears throat> Excuse me how things go. Uh, here's the cool thing, though. We can now make, we can make a blue pump shotgun, you guys. I'm so stoked, and I believe we have everything we need to make it. So we're going to need uh, 45 steel, and we have... Oh, no, no, no. Really? Are we... Sh we're short two st uh, five steel? Let's take a look. Shotgun pump. Yeah, yeah, we're short five steel. Okay, I'm going to have to go wrench some lamp posts. We got enough parts, and we can make the duct tape, the polymers, the spring, all that stuff's not a big deal, but... um. Crap. Okay, so I'm gonna run out really quick and just find a couple of lamp posts uh, to wrench. Shouldn't take long at all, and then I'll meet you back here and we will make our blue pump shotgun. I'm very pumped that we can make our blue pump shotgun. Oh, there was one other thing I was gonna tell you too, and that is that in the grocery store, I found another um, bar brawling magazine. No, not the bar brawling. I'm sorry, it's the robotic tech junkie so we found the one uh, where robotic weapons do 10 percent more damage and my inventory was so damn full i just decided to read it um because well my inventory was so damn full okay so i just need to find a couple of lamp posts let's go look for those really quick and then we'll come back and make that oh you know what there's five or six of those suckers right here at the water the water place and i don't believe i've looted them yet so that's what we shall do All right, so we got a total of 10 uh, steel bars from that deal, just from the waterworks alone. That's not too bad. Yeah, there's six uh, six street lamps in that place. Probably the PLI that has the most street lamps that I can think of off the top of my head. So it's a good place to go. Okay, now we should have everything we need. So let's grab the steel. We only need 45. Um, let's see, what else did it say we needed? Uh, we need 15 shotgun parts. So there's 15 right there. Plus I've got a bunch of shotguns I can take a, take apart too for later. If we need to. Okay, we need, um, 9 duct, 60 poly, and 9 springs. 4 minutes and 36 seconds, ladies and gentlemen, and we're gonna have a blue pump shotgun. So awesome. So awesome. Alright. So, yeah, I'm just going to wait uh, for that uh, to finish, and then when it does, I'll bring it back. We'll get it modded up, and then we'll go do that quest. And the other thing I was thinking, guys, I, I have these two pump shotguns on my toolbar, but I've never actually used the other one because, I mean, we've got 11 shots in this one. I don't know how many we'll have in the blue. I'm starting to think maybe it's not worth it to, you know, take up a spot with that. Uh, and so, you know, we're going to take the mod off of there for sure and we'll use this as one of our three mods on our blue shotgun i'm going to hang on to this for now though i'm not going to get rid of it yet and i might keep this in the second slot i don't know we'll see i'll think about it but anyway i'll bring you back uh, when that pump shotty is done 
All right, guys, we are back at uh, the shopping mall. As you can see, I now have a blue shotgun in my uh, third slot on the toolbar. Uh, this shotgun does 20 damage per pellet with the three mods. And as you can see, I got the tube mod, the duck bill, and the cripple em, uh, mod. All of that stuff I already had. I didn't have to make them. Um, so let's go ahead and we're just going to speed run uh, this uh, building here and get through it really quickly. And then hopefully we have enough time to start one of our other quests. So let's get uh, rolling on this. Yeah, where the hell's everybody at? Grab that stuff. No zombies in here either, huh? What is this? This is a clear and retrieve. Okay, I'm gonna toss that stuff later. Gotta be zombies in here. Let me have black heads lined up. Oh, you're a feral, darling. Okay, let's check here. Got some machine gun parts. What are we wearing? Let's put, um... XP glasses on. Well, you know what? Actually, no. Let's keep Lucky's on for now. Okay. Those are empty. <laughs> Trying to take Darlene's leg off. <laughs> With our triple mod. Okay, there's a thing back here. Yeah, I guess none of this stuff's lootable. At least it wasn't last time. Yeah, it doesn't look like it. A bit of gunpowder action. Got more hand action. Oh, we're supposed to go this way. I mean, I guess we can go either way now, but this is the way that I usually go. When I do this POI, I'll come back maybe for the cobble and all that stuff later. So we got three Zikaroos. Get them heads lined up. Boys and girls, there you go. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Lots of corpses to harvest in here. We'll come back to that stuff later maybe. The last time I went through here uh, on my own, I went and got all that stuff, so. Take that, don't care about the, that stuff. This is unfortunately not lootable. Here, I wish it was. But it's not. Uh, take that, don't care about the plastic. Got plenty of that. <laughs> stone arrows, really, game? I think we're a little, little past stone arrows at this point. There we go. Gotta take her off the leg. Now we got more guys in here. This is what I was expecting last time. Don't know why we didn't have very many before. What do we got here? Three irons. Okay, let's get these. We have a full stack and then some of those, so let's, well, you know what? Actually, we'll drink this just to free up the spot. Okay, I'll worry about ditching stuff after we got a full inventory. Let's grab this. Check the sink. And the coffee maker. Hmm. Let's grab that. Nope, don't want it. Don't want it. Hello, zombies. <laughs> Stop him right in his tracks. Here's your satchel. Nothing there. That stuff. Oh, where are you going, man? Wow, look at all the stuff in here, uh, including some eye candy. I got money down in the bike. What we might do is come back down here and grab this before we do the end loop, if I remember. <laughs> I know that's a big if, isn't it? Okay, let's get rid of this. Let's get rid of that. Let's get rid of those. And that, and that, and that. I'm gonna keep the cornmeal for now. This we can uh, scrap that and this. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna scrap the cat too. Okay, let's eat this. And I think we're... You know, I don't want one leather in my inventory, so let's fix that. Or in one way to skin a couch. There, now we have ten leather in our inventory. Oh shit. Ronald! Hello, Ronald. Are you dead? Yeah, he's dead. <laughs> he is dead. Uh, okay. Let's see. Those are not lootable. Check this. Aha! Okay, so, uh, we're gonna go ahead and use this now. And then, that is it for Jailbreaker Candy. From now on, we're just gonna use our bazillion lockpicks. I should have waited. We could have come back to do this one, too, while we still had the eye candy active, but... Oh, we haven't opened it, have we? Okay. We'll do that. We'll come back and do this, too. 
You guys just have to remind me, okay? No zombie in there? I'm starting to collect the rotten flesh now because uh, we will be doing a garden here at some point fairly soon. Probably not until we get the, the main part of the house built, though. Okay. Bust this open. Alright, so we want the money. Get rid of that, get rid of that, keep that, get rid of that. This we can scrap. <coughs> okay, that door's workable. Okay. Hello, boys and girls. We got three of them. Until we get all here. There we go. Man, look at all the cement in here. In the last episode when I blew this place up, I actually destroyed a bunch of the cement, so I won't be doing that this time. I mean, it's always fun to watch things go boom, but that is a lot of cement. Okay, there aren't usually buzzards on this side of the roof. There are usually buzzards here. And one more. No glowers this time, huh? Big Mama looks like she just wants to chow down on you. Okay, um, I'm gonna grab this stuff. Oh, well, we want to actually go get the eye candy now, so let's jump back down here. Uh, yeah, the eye candy's here. In fact, I'm going to buy all the food here, too, since we have a little room now. I don't really want the Adam Junkies. Yeah, we'll leave the rest of that. Okay, so we have Lucky Looters on. Yep, let's eat this. Let's see what we got. A uh, knife upgrade, maybe? This does six block damage versus uh, six block damage. So it's the same, but it's better in other ways, so we'll probably switch that out. Okay, let's just run over here really quick. Where are we at? Okay, that loots. Weapons bag. Okay. And this guy. Which, actually, I guess our, our jailbreaker's still active too, isn't it? Well, that works in our favor. Hmm. Okay. Nothing too terribly spectacular, but we'll take it, I guess. Okay, let's see. How much time's gone by? Yeah, we, I think we have enough time to do um, another quest. So I will meet you at the next quest location. Well, actually, where's the turn-in for this? Let's take a quick look. Um, this turn-in... Is that Trader Joel? No, that's Trader Hugh, by our house. Okay, I'll meet you over there first. We'll do our turn-in. And then uh, we'll go to the next closest quest, wherever that happens to be. Hey, buddy. Ah. Well, I guess you ain't so bad. That's nice. There's a little something for your trouble. That's actually quite nice. Um, we are taking that for sure. <laughs> Whether we use it or not, it, it's definitely worth the most out of everything that's here. Okay, let's take that. Um, you don't reset till day 25. Yeah, okay. Um... Okay, let's take I only the next do job. With real customers. Now I think we're gonna go. We're gonna go east towards uh, the desert, but he doesn't have anything to the east, darn it. Uh, all right. Well, this will go. This one will go back to Trader Joel's town, and it's so house old Spanish. Ooh, I wonder if that's one that has the like the mad scientist place down underneath it. Busters, hackers, tuna, and grain alcohol. The rest of that stuff we're going to leave there. All right, guys. I'm going to stop off the house, drop some stuff off, do a little inventory management, and then I will meet you. Um, let's go. Let's go ahead and do the go to the desert just for a little change of scenery. We'll, so we'll do this uh, desert quest over here. So I'll meet you guys over there. All right, guys. I'm back. Um, I just opened up this red car and look what I found in there: the machine gunner. Um, craft M60 machine guns. Oh man, that's gonna be awesome. I never even found this in our uh, in our um, experimental playthrough. Uh, super nice. Fine. Okay. Cool. Speaking of machine guns, um, I uh, had to kill a couple buzzers right before I caught uh, started the camera. I went ahead and retired the orange 
um, TAC rifle and went with this AK because it was just so much better than the TAC rifle uh, was. And I even replaced my level one sniper rifle with it uh, and put the 2X scope on here. Uh, with the mods, this is only two points less damage than the you know than the level one sniper rifle was, anyways. Uh, and it holds 43 rounds in the chamber. And um, so yeah, this is this is it was too good to pass up, and I didn't want to have an AK and attack rifle. Uh, hopefully, we'll you know we'll come across a better attack rifle, or, or I can even make one too once we you know um, uh, get the right uh, stuff for it. Uh, later, um, so hopefully we'll be able, we'll be able to go back to the tack rifle, uh, but for now this is definitely the better choice of weapon for us. Uh, but now that we found that um, M60 too, oh man, that's a nice find. We definitely at some point right have got to put some points into machine gunner because I don't want to make either one of those weapons until we can make it you know a blue weapon, which means we have to be level four in both skills in order to to make those. Uh, okay, let's go ahead and get that all taken care of. Um, I also changed a couple of clothing items so we can handle the heat in the desert. So I put the ball cap mod on our helmet. I switched out my BDU top for this tank top because it had two more points of heat resistance. And, you know, we're already wearing the uh, leather duster, which has excellent heat resistance. So, so far, I haven't uh, even seen the orange uh, heat thingamadoodle. Oh, we've got ourselves a wandering horde. Oh yeah, this house, okay. Yeah, this one's easy to double loot. Alright, so let's deal with these guys. <laughs> really gonna stop right there? Let's try out our new AK here. The the sights don't come all the way together, so these really long shots are not super accurate. All right, I'll put her down. Is it just you, Egger? Let's get the rest of these Zeekers out of here. She is wicked fast. He is too, for that matter. Not faster than my shotgun, though. We got a twofer and we didn't even know it. Is there anything here? Nada. Okay, so this house has a landmine in it, but we read the magazine where we can step on those and that doesn't bother us, so we don't really have to worry about that, do we? Um alright, so we'll do an easy double loot here because the loot is just right underneath this pile of dirt. Okay, let's see what we got. We have our luckies on, right? Yeah. And the fat loots. Alright, we will sell those. I think we were supposed to stand up on the stone blocks that we took out.
There is a fair number of radiators in this house. We are definitely going to get those. Push up there. We will take the um, the black die off of that. Three Zikaroos. Where's the other one? Oh, it's a crawler. Easy. Some ammunition. Got an easy there and probably something in that closet. Maybe? What the hell? Oh, it's another easy. Nothing in here. Nope, there is a duffel bag right there. Can't quite reach it. There we go. Take that. You know what? Actually, I'm going to take those since we're starting to think about a garden here pretty quick. Which way am I supposed to go? I'm not sure. Oh, okay. I guess we're supposed to go down. Hello, zombies. More black tie, nice. Uh, nope, don't want that. All right, let's see here. One Zikaru. Off of his leg. Huh? Forty-four dollar Mickey Hala. Sorry, I'm not talking as much as normal, guys. I'm just getting kind of tired. I'm going to bed after this for sure. All right. Can we get a Zeke to step on that? It's not going to hurt us. See? Yep. <laughs> I just, you never know for sure, but uh, I knew it wasn't going to hurt us. Come on, you guys. Have a little more faith. <laughs> yeah, anyways, I'm like really tired, so I'm going to bed right after I'm done recording this. 
Um, so, bear with me. Okay, let's get rid of that. Let's scrap a doodle of that. Can't get rid of that. We're gonna drink a doodle of that. And we could stand to eat something, so let's eat this. Okay. Uh, is that everything? We need to check the coffee maker. Sure, that's a thing of duct tape right there. Oh, shit! That guy didn't waste any time, did he? Is he dead? Yeah, he's dead. Easy. Vending machine. Uh, don't mind if I do. Ammo pile. Dang it. I'm not drinking another one because I don't need to right now. Scrap that and scrap that. Okay. We're just about done, you guys. Just about done. Ah, there's some more luckies. Nothing going to jump down on top of me from the ceiling? No, but there is a couple of things up here. Some food. And a trash. <laughs> uh, you know what? I'm not taking three gunpowder. Okay, that's it. Didn't get anybody's attention, huh? Nothing up there, or did I destroy it? Shotgun storm. That's the way we like it. All right, let's see. Is there something back here? Yes, there is. Okay, we already got one of those, but... Okay, we don't have an eye candy, do we? I don't think we do. Okay, let's see what we got. Ooh, that's nice. Those are probably... Nope, they're not armor or uh, better. They're a little bit better crit-wise, but they're also one slot less, so we're probably just going to sell those. Oh, the loot's just slowly getting better and better. Just slowly. There we go. Okay. Marksman rifle schematic. We will eventually, I'm sure, come across the... Um, uh, what am I trying to say? The, the actual sniper rifle, which I really like. So, uh, okay, here. Let's ditch that. Let's eat this. And we're going to take this for sure. We're going to scrap that and grab... Well, yeah, that might be worth taking and selling, I guess. Ooh, yeah, we need those two things too. I don't want to come back down here, so what are we going to give up? Let's drink this. That didn't help us, did it? 
Um, we can make a duct tape. That'll free up one slot. Uh, no, it won't, actually. <laughs> it did free up a slot. Shit. Um, we can still eat one more thing, so let's eat the pears. This we're going to fix up and sell. All right. Um, so, uh, we don't care about that. All right, what do we got in here? Hopefully ammo we can loot. Nope. Dang. Damn it, Jim. All right, here, let's eat this and grab that. Okay, I think we got all the critical stuff. All right, guys, that is it for this episode. Hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, please hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment. Share out the video. We'll catch you in the next episode where we will do whatever the next thing is we're going to do, which I'm not even sure what it's going to be yet. But we'll figure it out. We will figure it out. All right, guys. Bye-bye.